thanks for joining us tonight at 7. I'm Kelly Swoop. And I'm Jamie Costello. Starting in November, if you are shopping in Baltimore County, you will no longer have the option of plastic single-use bags. Today, as WMR2 News' Jeff Hager reports, County Executive Johnny Olszewski signed the controversial measure into law. For now, those wispy plastic bags remain both free and convenient for shoppers in Baltimore County, but not for long. It's a pain, you know. Because this is convenient for me, like walking, I can balance myself out with, you know, two bags. But too many of those bags are taking a toll on the environment, and Baltimore County Executive Johnny Olszewski signed a bill into law at the Turner Station Park Pavilion on Friday, outlawing those bags starting on November 1st. We know that plastic bags have littered our streets and green spaces, damage our waterways, and have been a nuisance in our landfills for far too long. This bill will cut down on the nearly 1 million single-use plastic bags that Baltimore County residents use almost every single day. The new plastic bag ban will affect all of the major retailers, but so-called mom and pops with less than four locations who aren't part of franchises will be exempt. Instead of the lightweight plastic, customers will have the option of buying paper bags for a nickel apiece or bringing their own reusable bags and environmentalists are applauding the measure. Next we're gonna go for straws and plastic spoons and forks and there's so much that we can do to um, help this county. Not that everyone appreciates the help. I think they're imprinted on everything. That's little things, you know, it's crazy. The county has pledged to provide free reusable bags to those who can least afford them before the lightweight ones become illegal. In North Baltimore, Jeff Hager, WMAR 2 News.